Hi everyone, and we're back today. And this time we're going to be upgrading a doorbell transformer for your home. The reason I'm doing this is because I went ahead and installed one of those new Ring Pro doorbells with the video cameras. And those doorbells require a minimum of 16 volts. Now this is a transformer. This is what a transformer looks like right here. So it's basically a coil. This is called a step-down transformer. On this side, these wires are the input from your household electricity. So you've got your typical white wire, black, and then green for ground. So it's just going to be simply matching up the black and the white wire to your current household. And then on the back, this particular one I actually picked up from Lowe's. And you'll see here that you see here on the left side it says 8 volts and it's pointing to the left and middle terminals so if you hook your doorbell up to that it'll give you 8 volts and 10 amps that's not going to do for our purposes so we're going to go up to the next one here so it's going to be the middle and the right one you see the two arrows and that's going to be 16 volts and that's just the right amount for our new ring doorbell this one down here actually says 24 volts, 20 amps, and ring will take all the way up to 20 vo 24 volts, but because my system was running on 12, I want to keep the original doorbell chime as close to the original voltage as possible. Now, locating this could be a little tricky. So what I did was I started with the uh, where the doorbell is in the house, so that's the front door and our house has a basement so I started looking directly beneath that a popular place to look would be in the furnace room so you want to look for something like this in the furnace room if you don't find that in the furnace room then you want to check by your electrical box now sometimes a furnace room will have this but it's used for controlling the valves for your furnace to allow heat into the different rooms so just make sure it's not it now I'm going to show you where ours was located ours was actually located underneath a fluorescent light underneath a raised ceiling and I was able to determine that because when I put my multimeter and I selected it to a volts here it read out 12 volts which was exactly 12 volts at the doorbell and so I'm going to now pan up and you're going to see the raised ceiling here. So you could see the fluorescent light is down so I could gain access to it. And right here you'll see I've already opened it up. This is what it looks like. This is our old transformer right here. Okay. And you can see the uh, you could see the wires, the two wires coming from the transformer. It's pretty old it just has two white wires doesn't have the current black white and green designation so it's just going to be a simple job of me taking this transformer out and swapping in the new one so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna start that I'm gonna put the camera down and I'll be right back okay what I've done is I've disconnected the uh, well, not disconnected. I've um, unmounted the transformer from the junction box now. Okay, can you see it here? Now I've switched off the power. Make sure you do that before you start getting in here. And now it's just a simple job of taking these two wires out and putting in the new one. So we'll be right back. Okay, I went ahead, I've wired it up here. And you can see that uh... all right well, we're outside now and you'll see I've mounted the uh, ring doorbell pro here I did a voltage test with my multimeter on the new transformer and it's actually putting just a little bit more out than 16 volts it's about 18 volts between fluctuating between 17 and 18 volts it's actually perfect and uh, again, that was a um, that was a multi voltage output transformer that I picked up from Lowe's, and it's right there in the doorbell section. So if you're having trouble finding it in the store, you could actually look it up 
online. You can order it, order it for pickup, or um, ask a sales associate to point you to where the doorbells are. But let's go ahead and give this a shot. Perfect. All right, so now I'm just going to go uh, back down. I'm going to go turn the power off while I button everything up. And that about does it for the transformer, doorbell transformer upgrade. All right, thanks everyone for watching.